what day it is. Guess what day it is. It is the day we're going to upgrade our supervisor from Niagara 4.10 to Niagara 4.13. So there's a couple of things we need to understand. We have a daemon home, which is where we can run a station on our supervisor. And then there is a user home where we save these offline stations. So I've already got my 410 daemon home running, and I even have a supervisor running named supervisor from 410. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start my Niagara 413 workbench, and I'm going to copy this 410 station to my 413 user home. So here's my Niagara Workbench for 4.13. I'm going to log into my platform. And from my platform, I'm going to log into or go into the station copier tool. We'll see in the daemon home here. Remember, this on the right-hand side is our daemon home for 4.10. That's the daemon that I'm running. I want to copy the station to my user home at 4.13. So I'll just left-click it, then hit the copy to the left arrow. Do you want to rename it? No, I'll leave that as the original. Maybe we'll even annotate at the end of it, original. And I'll copy it. I'll copy every file every time. And I'll finish. It'll copy it over. It's done. So now what I need to do is start my 413 daemon. I'm going to go down to my start menu. I'm going to scroll all the way down to V for Vicon, because I'm using a Vicon brand workplace. And I'll start my 413 daemon. Here's my little black box. This will go away in just a moment. And when it does, my Niagara service for 413 should be running. So out of best practice, what I'm going to do here is actually close my 413 workbench. And for giggles, I'll close my 410. I'm then going to open up my 413 again. Here's Vicon 413. Open it with the console. That's this little black box. Here's a little output. You can tell us what's going on. It can take a minute. And here it is. I'm going to log back into my platform. And I'm going to go into my station copier. Here's my station copier of my platform. And what I'm going to do is take this supervisor from 410 original, and I'm going to copy it over to my 413 daemon home. Notice the stations have changed because the daemon that's running has changed. Click my copy button. Maybe I'll say 413. 413. Press the wrong button. Click next. Ah, start after install is fine. Click next and finish. All right, it copied it over. Let's check out this application director to see if this is running. And we can see all the errors that happen here. Here we got some warnings. It's yelling at us because, hey, we're using the default credential. We've done a video on certificates already, or at least a little bit about them. Oh, there it is. My Fox port is running. I can right-click my host and open that station up. And ta-da, that's my 410 supervisor running 14, 413. It's using all of my features and modules from my daemon home from 413. Congratulations. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and have a great day.